Live now to Cairo, we'll talk to our correspondent there, Christian Fraser. Christian, how is this all being viewed where you are? Well, Egypt has summoned the Israeli ambassador over the past few hours to demand an end to the bombardment of Gaza. And meanwhile, the Egyptian president, Hosni Mubarak, has ordered the opening of the Rafah crossing. Uh, this is the checkpoint between Gaza and Egypt so that the more seriously wounded can be treated in Egyptian hospitals. As we know, there are estimated to be around 600 who are injured. Uh, the problem is that at the moment, they've nobody to treat. They've got helicopters and doctors on standby at the Rafah crossing. There are up to 40 ambulances waiting to go into Gaza to bring out uh, the injured and tons of medical supplies have arrived at the nearby airport of El Arish, including two flights from Qatar. Uh, but the Egyptian Foreign Minister Ahmed Abul Gate said in the past few hours that they've had no one come across. The wounded, he said, are barred from crossing, and he blamed those in control of Gaza for putting the lives of the injured at risk. Mahmoud Abbas, we understand, has been in Cairo as well. Who's he been talking to?